rational equations. The first examples. Yeah, some more harder ones to follow. But on these, we see that we have rational equations, meaning that we have fraction actions. So, in order to get rid of the fractions, we need to multiply by the common denominator. What's the common denominator between 4 and 3? 12. So, our common denominator is 12 and x, because that's the first product that all three of these will divide. So we're gonna come up and we're gonna multiply everything by that common denominator. So that's 12x times that 4 over 3 plus 12x times that 1 over 4. That's gonna be equal to that 12x times 1 over x. What's next? Anybody see anything that can reduce? All day, every day. Uh, uh, you're a 4. You're a 1. And then 4 times 4 is 16x plus, uh, uh, you're a 3. You're a 1. Is there a 2 there? No, that was a 12. So that's a 3x. That's going to be equal to, uh, uh, oh, 12. Finish him. No, finish him. Oh, that is really equal to. Boom. 16 and 3 is 19x. That's equal to 12. Finish him. Divide both sides by 19. So I divide this side by 19. Get down there. That's going to be equal to... Whoa, divide that side by, that's not equal to 19, all right? So then x is equal to 12 nineteenths. Can the answer be a fraction? It just happened. Let's make sure, boom, three, four, 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 uh-huh, yeah, oh, okay. And then, yeah, oh, fine, done. Box and flower. I'm done, I'm done, and I'm on to the next one. Yeah, so up here, one third minus 7 25ths y is equal to 8 25ths minus 1 15th y's. It'd be wise for us to find a common denominator. The common denominator between the numbers, boom, 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 looking like 75. 75, and then, oh, looks like y's in there too. If you want to see the videos on Finding a common denominator, they're there, just search my YouTube channel. And now we go and we multiply everything, everything by 75y, by 75y, by 75y, by 75y, why? So we can clear those fractions, what? I'm really multiplying this side by 75 and distributing in, and I'm multiplying this by 75y and I'm distributing in. Now, we reduce. Here I see we can reduce by 3. 75 divided by 3, that's 25y minus 75 divided by 25, that's 3. Uh, uh, you're a 3. 3 times 7 gets you 21. Uh -huh. And then the y's, uh, uh, oh, that's going to be, that's going to be, oh, that's a three, uh, uh, you're a three. Three times eight is 24. Now, if I make any mistakes in here, post it down below. Then, boom, uh-huh, 24, y, because that didn't have a y in it. Here are the y's, uh, uh, 75, and goes into 15, goes into 75, uh, uh, five times, so that's a minus five, and then the y's are all gone. Now I got y's on both sides, when I'm on one side, which side, don't care. Probably the left, left siders, subtract a 24y, and that's just one y. Shorten that up. If I had 25 and somebody took 24, I'd be disappointed but I'd have one y. Minus that 21, that's gonna be a minus five. Okay, so to get rid of that 21, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna add 21 to both sides, add 21 to both sides, so then y turns out to be, wait for it, wait for it. 16? 16. Positive 16, but if you don't believe me, Check it! Throw it back up into the original, see if it works out. 
Bottom flower. Done. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.